Good morning, dear learners. I hope you are okay by the grace of the Almighty. You know, we are passing a very bad time. I mean, coronavirus, COVID-19. Yet, our online education is going on as a part of the program. Today I am here. I am with your English textbook, you know. This is English, English for today, for class 11 and 12. Today, our topic is, it is from Unit 1. You know the title of the unit, you know the title of the unit, what is the title of the unit? People or institutions making history. This is the title of unit 1. And our today's topic is lesson 2, that is the, unfor the unforgettable history. What is the topic? The unforgettable history. It means 7th March speech of our father of the nation, Bangabandhu, Sheikh Mujib Rahman. And I believe, I believe you know the basic matters related with this speech. Bangabandhu delivered this speech at Race Course Maidan. At the time it was called race course now. Sorar the Yuddhan. And Bhumamudu delivered this speech and it was started after 3 pm. And its duration was 18 minutes or a little bit more. There are 1118 words in the space and there are 126 lines. Why it is unforgettable history? Why it is called unforgettable? Because we cannot forget it by any means. Several incidents, lot of incidents occur in our life but all are not important. Some incidents are very much important and we can never forget them. Okay, let us see, let us see the book and this is your textbook you know. And this is the lesson. This is the lesson. You see the great man, hero of the nation, Bangladesh Sheikh Mujibur Rahman, is delivering his peace. You see his great, his gigantic figure. Thousands of people, thousands of people. They are eagerly listening to his speech. There are two parts. There are two parts in this speech. First part, Bhagavad is speaking, was speaking about the malpractices of the Pakistan, of the Pakistani rulers in the first part. And in the second part, he gave direction to the audiences what to do or not to do. Okay. I just begin the speech. I just begin the speech from 
first line. It is the beginning words, my brothers. I stand before you today with a heavy heart overflowing with grief. Bengali is almost forbidden in communicative English class. This message was given to us at our training program. But in reality, some words, some Bangla words are essential for Bangla speaking people because without Bangla, we cannot express the real meaning, the intended meaning. I can say, my brothers, Bhai Ramar, in the language of Bangabandhu, I stand before you today with a heavy with a heart overflowing with grief. As as First lines. You are fully aware of the events that are going on and understand their import. We hope sorry, we have been trying to do our best to cope with the situation. And yet, unfortunately, the streets of Dhaka, Chittagong, Khulna, Rashahi, and Rangpura are awash with the blood of our brothers. The people of Bengal now want to be free. The people of Bengal now want to live, and the people of Bengal now want their rights. Amra, you are fully aware of the events. Mangurudu bol chen zora tar udeshye. Ap tar shabai abogoto. Amader ekhane ki khote jachche. Amra amader shadhamu to chesta kori si. Puri si the shathe khap khaye cholte. Kino durbhagyo boshoto. Ekhono dhaka chhattogram khulna. Rasta hirongpur. Ei shabai lekar rasta goli. Rasta ghat rokti feshe gachche. Banglar manush mukti chai. Banglar manush bhaste chai, Banglar manush tadir udhikar chai. So, these are the beginning words. Very emotional, very dramatic, very arresting language. And you see, it is the, it is the practice of a good orator, a good speaker. A good speaker knows how to arrest the attention of the audience and Bangamundhu, you know, is a famous orator also. He is not only a politician but also a good speaker. I see, now I see last few words from revolutionary committees under the leadership of the Awamili in every village, every community be prepared to act with whatever you have in your position. Remember, since we have already had to shed blood, we shall have to shed a lot more of it. By the grace of God, however, we shall be able to liberate the people of this land. The struggle this time is a struggle for freedom. The struggle this time is a struggle for emancipation. Long live Bangladesh. Long live Bengal. Bangladesh say, long live Bengal. Last words, you know, the struggle this time is a struggle for freedom. The struggle this time is a struggle for emancipation. Emancipation. These are the words, and I think you understand what is freedom and what is emancipation. Two words, related terms, but different meanings. What is freedom? Freedom means it is related with politics. Sovereignty of a country, political system, economic system, these are related to it. Freedom. Freedom means what? Freedom means politically free. And what is emancipation? It is the free condition from all kinds of deception, deprivation, as we were under Pakistani rule. And these languages, you have to read again and again 
we have to read again and again these 126 lines. If you read once, you will just see the words. If you read more than one, you will understand. And if you really want to get the message, you must read more than three times. And I write few words. I write few important dates, especially here. These dates, you need these dates and you will understand few words, few dates and you will understand its meaning. Okay. Now I am erasing the board and I shall write something new. Just follow me. Just follow me and open your textbook because without textbook you will not understand the message. Few dates, few years, 1958. I write 1958. These dates, these years are highly related with this piece. 1958. What happened? During this time, martial law declared by Ayub Khan in 1958. Amra in Bengali we say Shamurikai, Atanu Shale Shamurikai. Then I write 1966. What is this? I think you know it. Six point movements announced by. What is six points moments? In Bangla we say Swadha Pandala. You know it better. This six points movement is the basic, is the root of our freedom. There is everything. Then I write February. February 23. What happened? I think you also know it. Bangladesh was given the title. Sorry, Sheikh Mujibur Rahman was given the title Bangladesh on this very day. A din tati Sheikh Mujibur Rahman ke Bangladesh badi diya hoye sir. E raage unish shudhui Sheikh Mujibur Rahman sirin. Ta bolle February 23. This is the day when. The title Bangabundhu was conferred, conferred on him by student leaders. And these words were uttered, the word Bangabundhu was uttered by Tofail Ahmed, then student leader. Now also, a leading Aumalik leader. Then I write. 7 December 7 December 1970 What is this? General election General election in the then Pakistan and victory of Aumabili, victory of Bangabandhu Great victory Next 25 March 1971 The tragic day Vidunar tragic day What happened? Suddenly at the dead of night Operation Searchlight Operation Searchlight By the name of this Brutus activities, Brutus program, Pakistani rulers killed thousands of our innocent Bangalis. So, these deaths are highly related with the speech of Bangabandhu. These deaths are highly related with the speech of Bangabandhu. And 
the first part you know bangabandhu gives us ideas makes us prepared and in the second part he gives us direction what is the language in bangabandhu speech be prepared from revolutionary committees under the leadership of the awami league in every village every community awami league er pokkho theke prottek gram e prottek ghore ghore durgo gore to be prepared to act with whatever you have in your position tomader ja ache tai niye juddher jonno prostut thako remember shoron rekho mone rekho since we have already had to shed blood amra rakto diyechi je tomra rakto diyechi we shall have to shed a lot more of it amader aro rakto dite hobe by the grace of god however we shall be able to liberate the people of this land er phole amra amader jati ke desh ke mukto korte parbo ebare sangram shadhinotar sangram ebare sangram mukti sangram live long live bengal bangladesh series of people actually this piece this piece is remembered and this piece is compared with another piece another great piece of the world that is martin luther king junior martin luther king junior he delivered a speech in 1963 at lincoln memorial in the us he and that speech was for the liberation of black people for the equal rights of black people and bangabandhu delivered his speech in 1971 7th march same same purpose almost same purpose the space place is different venue is different the matter is the same place is different venue is the different but matter is the same and you know this piece was unwritten the most important aspect of this piece that is this piece was unwritten and declared by the speaker i mean bangabandhu sheikh mujibur rahman instant instantly without preparation it is a history it is a world history this is a world history and you know this piece is already translated in 12 languages of the world itimoddhe 12 ti bhashay ei jatir jonok bangabandhu shekh mujibur rahman er bhashon ti onudito hoyeche and it is a very very great achievement for us it was recorded in the register of UNESCO in 2017 October 30 this piece was registered by the UNESCO and as a student as a bangladeshi i believe and even as a citizen of the country it is our first and foremost duty i believe to read this space another important thing and i also believe you know it who is the who is the translator of this piece bangabandhu delivered this piece in bangla who translated it in english professor fakrul alam professor 
look at the board professor hok rule alo professor hok rule alo english department university of dhaka he has translated the speech of bangbandhu in english into english so you have to read this piece again and again and there are different words different ideas and different meanings and you see about bangabandhus bangabandhu was born you should know his beginning because there is no scope to become a leader overnight ratarati neta howa ratarati mohan howa kono bhabe somvab noy kaje amader shei bishoy gulo bhabte hobe jante hobe you i think you know the birthplace of bangabandhu he was born at tungi para a remote village under gobalganj district then gobalganj mahakuma father sheikh lutfur rahman mother saira khatun bangabandhu joined all india muslim students federation in 1940 উনি উনিশশো চল্লিশ সালে সর্বভারতীয় মুসলিম ছাত্র ফেডারেশনের সাথে যুক্ত হন এরপর ইন নাইনটিন ফর্টি থ্রি হি জয়েন্ট বেঙ্গল মুসলিম লীগ ইন নাইনটিন ফর্টি থ্রি উনিশশো তেতাল্লিশ সালে যোগ দেন বেঙ্গল মুসলিম লীগে অ্যান্ড অ্যাট দ্য টাইম হি বিকেম ক্লোজ উইথ অ্যানাদার গ্রেট লিডার হোসেন শহীদ সৌরওয়ার্দী উনিশশো তেতাল্লিশ সালে তিনি বেঙ্গল মুসলিম লীগে যোগ দিয়ে শহীদ সৌরওয়ার্দীর ঘনিষ্ঠজন হয়ে ওঠেন ইন নাইনটিন ফর্টি এইট বঙ্গবন্ধু ফাইট ফর বাংলা ল্যাঙ্গুয়েজ দিস ইজ দ্য ফার্স্ট মুভমেন্ট ইউনো ইন ইন দেন পাকিস্তান অ্যান্ড হি ওয়াজ ইমপ্রিজেন্ট এবং উনি জেল খাটেন ভাষার জন্য বঙ্গবন্ধু জেল খাটেন ইন নাইনটিন ফর্টি এইট দিস আর দ্য ভেরি ইম্পর্টেন্ট ম্যাটার্স রেগারি বঙ্গবন্ধু 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 মুসলিম লীগ ত্যাগ করে বিশিষ্ট নেতা হোসেন সোহরওয়ার্দি এবং মৌলানা ভাসানির সঙ্গে আওয়ামী মুসলিম লীগ গঠন করেন এবং দলের যুগ সম্পাদক হন ইন নাইনটিন ফিফটি থ্রি বঙ্গবন্ধু বিকেম জেনারেল সেক্রেটারি ইন নাইনটিন নির্বাচনের মাধ্যমে পূর্ব পাকিস্তান আইন পরিষদের সদস্য হন এবং কৃষি মন্ত্রিত্ব লাভ করেন এরপরে ইন নাইনটিন ফিফটি সিক্স হি জয়েন্ট ইন নাইনটিন ফিফটি সিক্স হি জয়েন্ট এজ এ মিনিস্টার কমার্স মিনিস্টার ইন নাইনটিন সিক্সটি থ্রি আপনার ডেথ অফ হোসেন শহীদ সরোয়ার্দি বঙ্গবন্ধু বিকেন দ্য প্রেসিডেন্ট অফ আওয়ামী মুসলিম লীগ ইন নাইনটিন ইন নাইনটিন সিক্সটি সিক্স দিস ইজ দ্য গ্রেটেস্ট টাইম দিস ইজ দ্য মোস্ট ইম্পর্টেন্ট টাইম ইন বঙ্গবন্ধুস লাইফ অ্যানাদার ইম্পর্টেন্ট টাইম মোস্ট ইম্পর্টেন্ট টাইম 
पाकिस्तान बिरोधी दल जतियों सम्मेलन पूर्व बांगला सहित शासन जो फर दटोनेमी अब इस्ट पाकिस्तान बंगबंधु प्लेस सिक्स पॉइंट मुभमेंट सिक्स पॉइंट मुभमेंट दें इन नाइनटीन सेवेंटी साधारण निर्वाचन जेनारे इलेक्शन आंडार द लीडरशिप अब बंगबंधु एंड हिड ए ग्रेट भिक्टोरि दें केम नाइनटीन सेवेंटी वन एंड सेवेंथ मार्च पीस यू नो एंड दिस इज आवर टूडेज टपिक After the speech, after the speech, after this historical speech, dictator Yahya Khan, Shamir Shahshan Jari Koren, he banned Awamili and ordered to imprison Sheikh Mujib, Sheikh Mujib Ke, Jeli Bundi Parar Nirdesh Dhan. Then came 25 March 1971. You know that black night. Thousands of our innocent Bengalis, intellectuals, they were butchered by the Pakistani armies. On this very night, I mean. March 25, after 12 p.m., Bangladesh declared independence of Bangladesh. From today, Bangladesh is independent. And before that time, he was arrested by the Pakistani army, and he was he was taken to Pakistan. And you know, then history. In 1971, April 17, Ostai Shorkar, Muslim Raghur Shorkar was found at Habertala Meherpur. Then, you know the history of Bengal, our liberation war, nearly nine months long liberation war, freedom fighters, sacrifices of our freedom fighters, different Parts of Bengal were destroyed, blood, crying, massacre, everything happened. Finally, with the help of our friendly country, India, and with their cooperation, Bangladesh became independent in 1971, December 16. January 10, 1972. Bangladesh came back from Pakistan via New Delhi. He came to Bangladesh. Amar jara ke ki bolii? Bangladesh bondho shodesh potta par tundi moshi. This is the political history, political background after words. What happened of this case? And you know, in 1975, August 15, that tragic day, August 15, that tragic day, everything was vanished. That black day, Bang Mudu Sheikh Mujibur Rahman, with his wife, Bang Mata Fazilul Tunnesa. Other leaders, his innocent son, a little boy, Sheikh Rasil, his two sons, their wives, Bangladesh brother and other relatives, they were killed, brutally killed, except two daughters. Luckily, two daughters. One is our present honourable Prime Minister Sheikh Hasina, and his and her. Sister Sheikh Rehana. Actually, this is the history, and we think this piece. This is a very, very important matter, and I believe NCTV, especially Minister of Education, has done a very, very good thing. 
it is very very important thing and because without knowing the history without knowing the speech of 7th march delivered by bangabandhu sheikh mujibur rahman our life will remain incomplete we may have different opinions we may have different political views it is different thing but in one point i think we should be united it is a you cannot imagine you are little boys and girls you will understand it better oh i will become older older and more adult what is said and what is not said here as a human being we have duties animals live only for themselves but human beings never do it as a human being it is our duty to think for others bangabandhu throughout his life the whole life his life is a long jail really many many years many many years he was in the dark house in the dark room of the prison without light without food even without newspaper but he did it for the love for his love and we should be motivated by this peace and i think millions of young generations of bangladesh will be motivated they will learn the message from this peace and they will try to imitate the life of bangabandhu he is our model he is our hero international hero because if we have a model before us it will be very possible for us to do something good in our life okay i tell you read the matter read the speech at your home at your home again and again and a home task a home task for you we shall talk more if necessary just follow me look at the board it is home task for you home task may a fact file make a fact file on on bongo bongo bondhus like i think you understand the meaning make a fact file on bangabandhu's life orthat bangabandhur jiboner je ghotona guli seta niye ekta ki ekta fact file toiri koro shekhane ki kothar theke ashbe from birth tale ekhane kothar theke shuru hobe birth birth to death and i believe you will be able to do it and i shall help you don't bother about mistakes just write try to write right or wrong it does not matter just try to guess the meaning try to write the message and uh, make a fact file i shall help you to write i shall help you to arrange from your part up to our next meeting up to our next schedule try yourself at your home and finally i okay let us 
close our uh, formal matter, I mean 7th March, Mr. Bangabandhu, we shall read it more and more and more and more. Okay, at the end of this online class, I tell you, you know, we are passing a very bad time, I told you. Coronavirus, I request you all to follow health rules, stay home and use napkins or other matters unnecessarily never go out go outside and follow health rules follow the instructions of the guardians let us hope for the best we shall overcome this calamity this pandemic and we shall again come to the classroom come to our classroom we shall again sit face to face i miss you i see your lovely faces but as we are passing a very, very unfortunate time, we are trying to do something through this online education. Let us have a good time. Thank you very much. Thank you.